so today we're going to try the bubble art. Um, you need your watercolours, some water, a paintbrush, something to mix your paints in. Um, it doesn't need to be a palette, you can just use jars or something. Um, and straw and your fairy liquid. So, what colour should we do, Alex? Which colour do you think? Brown. Okay, we'll start with brown. You need quite a bit of colour uh, of paint. Okay, so make sure you've got a good amount of colour in there. And add some water. I'm gonna maybe add a wee bit of red to that to make it a nicer colour. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. The red. Okay, and then when you're happy with your colour, you need to add really quite a bit of fairy liquid or else it won't make bubbles. So add in some fairy liquids. Swish them out. Sit down, please. Okay, and once that's all mixed in, you can get your straw. Give it a dip in and then just blow onto your paper. Okay, and don't pop the bubbles, let them just sit there for a while because you'll get a better colour onto your paper. Sit back please. You will get some sort of spray as well on your paper but it looks quite nice. You can just keep turning the paper. change colour. You can keep it all one colour or keep changing your colour. So we'll try um, if we got a red. Come sit down please. You want to try blowing it? Yeah? So we'll make the colour. I'll do a little bit of orange. Mommy, mm -hmm. Get your hair out of it. Add in your water. Just make sure it's a bright enough colour. And then add in our fairy liquids. to put something underneath your paper because it does get a bit everywhere. And another go. Are you making a new colour? And then just keep switching colours until you're happy. So I'm just going to go on and finish this page.
okay so I'm quite happy with how that looks and um, you can obviously just leave it like that uh, you can frame it or you can use the paper and um, maybe to make something we're calling silhouette art and um, so I'll show you how that's done in just a moment okay so this is just one option you could do, use with your bubble art come sit down for me honey and I was holding my swirly put your hands out and put them wide roll up your sleeves perfect and we can draw around them So you could cut that out or you could paint around um, so you've only got bubbles in the hand area. You could paint everything else black or the block colour. Um, you can also do this as a silhouette. So if you put this piece of paper on the wall, a mask can tape it up and then get someone to stand in front of the paper and shine a light from behind them. Then you can draw around their silhouette of their face and do the same thing, either cut it out or um, use a block colour to paint around the edge. And you'll have a really nice silhouette. Unfortunately, I couldn't get my daughter to stand still long enough to do that one. Um, but you can get some really nice images if you play around with it. Okay, thanks.